Let's do a review of age adjustment, this time using pooled population from uh, the two, points, uh, two populations of comparison. In this, we have Hospital A and Hospital B. There are two age groups, less than 50 and greater than 50 years of age. We have deaths, patients, and then the death rate per 1,000. So in these two hospitals, first we're going to look at the crude mortality and we take then the number of deaths over the total number of patients and we get a crude rate of 40 per 1,000. In Hospital B, it's also 60 over 1,500 for a crude rate of 40 per 1,000. But when you look at the age-specific mortality as it's given here, which in the less than 50 age group would be 10 over 500 for 20 per 1,000 and 30 per 1,000 for 30 per 1,000, then you see for both age groups that Hospital B is higher than Hospital A, making us wonder if they have higher mortality rates and if the crude mortality rate is actually then reflecting what's going on. So we want to calculate, a, do a direct age adjustment of the crude rates to compare the mortality to see if the differences due to age adjustment might go away. This is the same table I had in the previous slide. But now I've added on a bit here to begin the age adjustment. And the first thing I'm going to do is create my standard population. In this case, I'm calling it a pooled population. And I take the total number of patients in Hospital A, total number of patients of Hospital B, pool them together for a total of 3,000. Now, I know that there's 500 in, in, the, in, the, in the pool group, then less than 50 years of age, I know that there's 500 plus 1,000, so there's 1,500 in the age group of the pool under 50 years of age, and there's 1,500 in the age group greater than 50. Now, when I look at the proportion of the population, of the total pooled population that is in each age group, I see that it's half and half. So 50% or 0.5 is the weight of the age group or the proportion of the population that's in each age group of the total. I've carried the death rate, the age specific rates over here just to make it easier to see. So this age specific rate of 20 is here and I take the weight of the age group times the rate for hospital A to come up with a rate adjusted hospital A of 10. So the weight of 5 times the 20 deaths per 1,000 is 10. For hospital B, 0 0.5 times 30 is 15. For the older age group, 0 0.5 times 50 is 25. 0 0.5 times 60 is 30. I then sum the columns to add the total age-adjusted mortality to have one measure that reflects the overall mortality experience. And in this case, then it's 35 compared to 45. So it would, hospital B has a higher age-adjusted mortality rate. I could have used as, a, as, a, as the standard the year 2000 population from the U.S. Census, and I would have had to divide the census data by these two age groups to make it comparable. So even though the crude mortality rates are the same, Hospital B has an older population, as we were able to see, and its crude mortality rate is higher.